Hey guys, the time has come now. We're going to epox we're going to epoxy this bad boy here. Boom. We got to get plastic down first, and then we'll get this this move to here, and then we'll epoxy. Rex, sit, sit, sit. Up, up. Bang. Bang. Takes a couple shots, my guy. Get that high five. Get that high five. Good boy. Good boy. So I'm sure you saw the little bit of struggle that Haley and I had putting this down, but we got it. And now we've got this all set up. But before we do that, Haley was kind enough to provide a test piece. So we're gonna test that now just to make sure that when we do the full project that there's no issues. The same exact wood, same exact paint. Also, I forgot to note that we do have, which is very important, air circulation so let's turn on this bad boy we got air circulation masks on and we're going to be wearing gloves to be safe nailed it First pour, definitely bubbly. I think if we did another pour, it'd be really soft. There's nothing wrong with it. So we're gonna go ahead and move to the final piece. The coat is pretty bubbly as you can see, but this is just the first coat. We just really wanted to make sure that everything was covered. And then the next coat will be the flood coat, which, which will self level and give you that really nice sheen. It made all the colors pop on each of the characters. Good job. Thanks. It's been a full 24 hours. We let that first layer cure. Let's go ahead and check that out. Man, it's so good looking. Just look how shiny all the characters, uh, the colors pop way more. It looks so good. We're gonna get that second pour done, put you on the time lapse so you can check that out. Let's do it. Now, all we need to do is wait for this to cure for three days, and then we'll add the dartboard, and we'll get it put up on that wall. I'm speechless. Look how dope this turned out. You see that straight light in there? Well, straight-ish, but still, for only two coats, which that's all we're gonna put on, this turned out super good. We're just gonna get it cleaned up real quick, and then get the dartboard on there, and then, we're going to use French cleats to actually mount it on the wall over there, so we'll have to get those installed on the back side. Yeah. 
Yo, what up? All right, babe, you ready for this moment? No. It's the big moment, guys. Throwing the first dart at the dartboard. Stressful? Yes. <laughs> We're gonna see what happens when she purposefully miss, misses what happens to the epoxy. Where was it? Right there. Look at that. You could totally like eventually Stand sand this down and just more epoxy. I threw that pretty hard too, so. You did what? I threw it pretty hard. Yay! Yeah.